In previous videos, we've already looked at selecting a clip, coming to Audio Suite, and of course, applying an effect, an Audio Suite effect, and rendering a new file right here on the timeline. But did you know you could also render clips using your Audio Suite effects right here in your clip list? So that's pretty, uh, pretty helpful as well. So let's just preview something here. I'll always be around. Maybe this one right here. If you're looking for that one there, just select it, come up here to Audio Suite. And what do we want on this? We'll just, uh, for ease, so you can really hear it, go to an EQ. We can preview it. If you're looking for, if you're looking for, adjust our volume there, for, our preview volume. For, it's just going to keep for, looping around. For, I could use a preset if I want. If Give some more air up here. All right. So we'll say that's what we want. Now we can just click render and watch right here as we get a new file over here in the clip list right there. As you can see up here, we have clip list selected by default because we already had that selected. If on the other hand, I selected something over here, I could go to playlist if I wanted to. But clip list and maybe this file right here, preview it previewing it through our selection here, or our settings, right? Say you like that for some reason, click render, and right there's that new file with the EQ3, uh, 7B and whatnot. So I can hold down Alt, of course, and actually hear that. Like so, maybe this file here. We'll say clip list, preview it. Fine doesn't sound good, but that's not the point here. So I just want you to see these files here. So this file here, this one has a tail on it, our uh, handles on it, because so we have two second handles there. And this is of course a uh, two seconds in length of handles there from uh, our selection. All right. And versus this clip here, which actually uh, doesn't have those handles on it. All right. And then the uh, original file there, then our affected one. Okay, and that's not all, of course. We can uh, do affect multiple uh, multiple files. Select one, shift select something else there, of course. If you need someone to turn to. So we'll say we need to normalize all of these in one go. Very easy, audio suite, in this case, other. And we're just gonna say normalize, but you can do this with EQ, compression, uh, guitar effects, absolutely uh, whatever you want. And uh, we don't have a preview option in normalize, but that's fine. Let me just do whole file there, click render and watch what happens. Boom, we get all of those new files there. Of course we can do use in playlist and select these here and uh, render all that. And there we go. So you can see all the new files there. All right, so just be aware of your clip list or playlist that you have there and you can render files here using your audio suite plugins, affect single clips, multiple clips with plugins with effects right from your clip list by using the audio suite plugins.